All right. We're gonna uh we're gonna try to make a phone call. Okay. Hello? Hello. Hello. Who's who's am I calling? <laughs> Hang on a second now. Hang on. Okay. Is this is this, is this Paula Dean? Yes, it is. It sure sounds like her. Well it is. What who am I talking to? Well, well, Paula. Um That's a deep subject. I can give you some hints, but you're gonna have to guess. And okay. this is gonna be a, a, a true test of our friendship, so I'm going to give you a couple hints. I hung out with your Texas boyfriend last night, Mr. Chad Breeder. You That's did? You did? I did. And he misses you. And then hint number two. Okay, you ready? Yeah. Within the past year, you slapped me square across the Oh, <laughs> oh, my baby girl, how in the world are you? <laughs> oh, I'm good, how are you? I'm good. I didn't catch your voice. I knew that it was familiar, but I couldn't put, I couldn't put a name on it. Oh, well, it is me. It's, it is y'all, Jenna. this is Jenna. She lives in Texas. And she has been here two or three times here in Savannah, hadn't she? And shot shows with me. And she's just this beautiful, sweet, wonderful chef. So tell me what you're doing, Jenna. Well, actually, Paula, we uh, we just came out with this, and I'm so excited. The past year and a half, we've been working on um, this new concept that's come into the stockyards in Fort Worth. And it's... It's an autograph collection hotel with a restaurant attached to it. And the hotel's called, uh, it's going to be called Hotel Drover. And the restaurant is 97 West. And I will be the executive chef. Get and out, girl. I, I'm not. I'm so excited. <laughs> and you I said this is in a stockyard. It's a stockyard. It's going to be fun. You're talking about where the cows and all that are... Walking around. Okay. You're you're exactly right. They do a herd twice a day. No. Right in front of the, right in front of the restaurant the hotel twice a day, there's going to be a herd that takes place where, <laughs> where basically they take all of the longhorns and walk them down, exchange, <laughs> cattle drive. It's just, it's too much fun. So oh, I, not- my goodness. Jenna, that is so exciting. And now, <laughs> where, where, what town is that? So that's going to be in the stockyards, which is in Fort Worth, Texas. Okay. I wonder how long far I'm from Fort Worth, Texas, when I go to Fairview and San Antonio, Eddie. Hi, hi, Jenna. Yeah. How far is Fort Worth from uh from Fairview or Dallas? Uh, so Fort Worth is only like 45 minutes from Texas. Okay. So when you're in Fort, when you're in Dallas next, we're gonna have to link up. I'm gonna have to get you out here and show you around and get your get some advice from you on on the restaurant because you have all the experience in the world and <laughs> show you show you what the hot yards is all about. I know everyone would love to see you. Well, I w- I would love to share in what I've learned through the years, Jenna. The space that you live in really affects the way you feel. So my first recommendation is start by updating your window treatments with Smith & Noble. Smith & Noble's beautiful handcrafted blinds, drapes, shades, and shutters are custom made just for you, and they offer different service options to fit your needs. To get started today, contact Smith & Noble to get my special limited time offer, 25% off on your window treatments, plus free design consultation. Create a space that you're gonna love. 
the details about my special offer, go to smithandnoble.com slash Paula. That's smithandnoble.com slash Paula. Or call 1-800-659-3300. That's 1-800-659-3300. I would love now. When when is the opening date for uh, the stockyard? So we're still about fifteen months out. We're planning on uh, spring of twenty twenty. So we have a little while to go. We we just broke ground, so it's going to be a while. Uh-huh. But right now, I'm just traveling around Texas, eating at the best restaurants, just getting inspired. Uh huh. The uh-huh. kind of menu I want to create and bring uh-huh. Uh-huh. to the so I mean I cannot complain. I'm I'm just I feel extremely blessed to Oh have, my gosh. That just, That's wonderful. That just helps me to hit the road and go eat food. So, <laughs> have you gained weight while you've been on this venture? I have gained a few happy pounds, but <laughs> I'm not even worried about it. I, uh-uh. I it. It's it's you know, shows them if I'm healthy. I'm not I'm not about skip any of these meals at any of these awesome restaurants. So. Who, who did you say <laughs> loves it? I miss that. My husband, Micah. Micah okay. Hi. Okay. <laughs> well, that was going to be my next question is how's your love life? <laughs> uh, my love life is, it is good. It, it is on fire. Yay. I have no complaints. <laughs> well, that that <laughs> is great, Jenna. Well, let you me, know, huh? Yeah. Go ahead. I was just going to say, because I, I know you can relate to this, but just having a little break from the last restaurant in transition to this new venture has been wonderful for the love life. I've been home. Yes. <laughs> and, and you know, it works better when you can be around. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> well, let, let me tell you our exciting news. Uh, yes. Bo- Bobby and Claudia, my daughter-in-law, Claudia, and Bobby, uh, uh oh, my other phone's ringing. It's my sissy. Tell her I will call her as soon as this is over. Excuse me, Jenna. Uh, they had triplets a, a week ago today. I, I've got two girls and another boy. So now I've got nine grandchildren. <laughs> oh, 